Let's see what's going on, guys, because I'm not seeing you feeling this goofy on goddamn energy. I feel like somebody is in the energy of, like, stalking, but stalking to, like, steal your ideas and to, you know, try to um, get you eliminated from something so that they can present your ideas, you know, like like this person will allow you or to um admit you to or permit you to um release something but only for them to steal it and to um come out and use you use your ideas here but they gotta eliminate you first okay here this could definitely be an instance to where like you could be a candy lady or some shave like you the candy lady in your apartment. It's just something like that. Something so simple as that. This person right here will literally try to get you fired. Um, not fired, but put out um, in the complex. They'll go to the rent office and complain on you, call the police on you, lie on you, play games here. All right. Um, they'll definitely report you like to the highest, whoever the fuck may be over the entire goddamn complex. They'll go and report you to them. They'll send people to your door to play at your door and shit. Okay? This person is still stupid as fuck right here. This person don't got no common sense. And they're doing all of this shit only because you're hustling. Mind your business here. You don't even know this person. This could definitely be somebody also, you know, just trying to get you put out so that they can be the candy lady right here. Okay? It's like they trying to steal the idea from you and invest in, you know, them being it. You know, they trying to bully you some kind of way because they ain't shit. They fake fucking flicks and then they like for real. The fuck wrong with this damn person? These people. Okay, this person's fed up with you. So they feel like, yeah, they got to come in now or never, goddamn, and steal some shit right here from you or, you know, steal this idea from you, but it's just like, what the fuck? Anybody can fucking sell some snacks and chips right here, goddamn it. It's like, you may, what the fuck? Like, you might do any anything right here, bro. I'm just saying, any idea. You could be at a job and you could voice your opinion about an idea at work. This person is gonna work real fucking hard to steal your idea to get you fired or get you demoted. Okay, here, get you uh put out of fucking position right here so that they can step up. Because they were neglected as a damn child, right? This person got some childhood trauma. This could definitely just be a co-worker. You don't even know this person right here. Nine times out of ten, you need to just check yourself. Because don't think that you're doing nothing wrong because some shit may not be going your way. No, you got somebody in your energy that's playing fucking games. And they're playing both fucking sides right here is what the fuck I feel. Because they don't have any new beginnings. They don't got no new ideas. I feel like this person is wasting a lot of fucking time trying to copy you right here, bro. Like... Regardless of whatever it may be, this person is playing games. They're trying to steal. That's just the, the fucking the energy of the reading. This person is a player. They're trying to fucking steal. They're a thief. This person is putting a lot of time and effort into being a goddamn thief. Just period. They playing games. But see, the thing is, they love playing games. They want to play games here. They want to play games. This person ain't phased by games. This is what they do. The fuck you mean? This person really phased by playing a game with you. They don't care. You're the perfect person to play with. <clears throat> to them, like I said, all this thievery here. Thief. Trying to play. Trying to steal your unexpected fucking income here. Period. That's what the fuck they're doing. That's what they're trying to do. That's the goal, the motive. Trying to steal your destiny when they don't even belong on this path. They don't belong. They don't belong on the field while they're playing. They don't belong there. Period. As the spirit said, they're on the wrong path. Person going the wrong way. They're not at home while they homesick. While they I ain't shit going right for this motherfucker because they homesick. You're not at home. You're playing in a wealthy man's domain here on a wealthy man's playground. You ain't got enough coins to gamble with these motherfucking gamblers. You don't. You're risking your life with some rich motherfuckers right here who got the money to bond out of jail right here. Okay, here. This person playing fucking gangs, or you are. But why are they coming in the energy here? The fuck, why? Why the fuck is this person in this energy? Why are they in the color of this energy here? 
look because of the fucking community because they want to be in the community instead of you they want you to be out of the community this person very childish this person whoever the fuck this person is is very goddamn childish they're a player they're, the, this person's playing games they're so used to playing these same goddamn games here and this person somebody could have been born on uh, July 11, 2015 or something significant could have happened July 11, 2015. Okay, here. What else is here? So, see, this person right here, I guess they just infatuated with the, you know, the thought of trying to come in and change some shit for you in the community. They, the, just the thought, just the mere thought of them coming in trying to gift you with some dumb ass shit right here. That you don't want, you know, that you're not working out on. You're not fucking concerned about anything this person got going on right here. You've already called judgment on this person and they're pissed. They're trying to come in and change shit, shift shit right here for this masculine here. That's the hill that high damn honor and their gifts. You got a gift right here that you're supposed to be using like all around the world. You are held at high ass honor right here in the spiritual realm. And I feel you need to be held at that same goddamn... um honor on the 3d here and see i feel like that is coming but you got this negative ass damn energy right here that's you know trying to stand in the way of your blessings and i feel like you can only you can only this person can only succeed if you allow them to okay basically they don't send you a message that's gonna cause you to act real immature right here okay but it's only to distract you this person want to get you upset, you know, maybe they want, I feel like this person is probably trying to record some shit, probably trying to get you on camera saying something. Spirit, give me some more, baby, because, yeah, I feel like this person is doing some dumb shit. Yeah, this is a dirty ass offer right here because somebody is destroyed, okay, and they should be moving on, but they're played the fuck out right here and they're stalking you. Because they can't take what you're supposed to be doing. Your destiny. Your spirit. Okay, here. They don't like that you don't hate yourself. What's this energy up to? What's this energy here up to, spirit? What's this opposing energy up to? Bad karma. <laughs> I felt that this person was trying to release some shit about you. But that it obviously was blocked as fuck. Yeah, it was blocked. I feel like I felt like they were trying to, you know, come out and release something to you, like into the public eye here with the community card, especially. But you know, spirit tired of the drama. Spirit tired of this person. I don't know how the fuck this person was expecting something to not go through for you when you're born to shine right here. I don't get it. It's like, but they know your position already. This person knows why they keep trying it. Who knows? Only they do. But you're unfazed anyhow, okay, fam masculine? You're unfazed. Just remain that way. I'm just saying, I felt like this person was definitely going to try to release something out about you. But like I said, they're getting, they're just having fucking bad karma right here. Okay? And you already know the tea with this motherfucker. You already know who the hell this is. You intuitively know all their plots, all their plans. Okay? You know that this person fake flips and anything that they say is bullshit. They just want you back and this person don't know how else to get you. I don't feel like there is no other way to get you. I feel like this person has royally fucked up any chance that they would have had, you know, to make anything right or work with you. Because one minute they salty, the next minute they sweet as fuck, like sugar. But they're holding grudges anyhow, period. Why the fuck would you, how could you hustle with a motherfucker in the background holding grudges here? How could you work with someone like that in private hating on you? How the fuck could you work with someone like that? Bringing bullshit your way every time you turn around. Every time you walk out your damn door, it's bullshit that you got to dust off and recover from here. Because you're on your path and this person is private hating on you because you're hustling. Shit weird. Telling stories once upon a time and shit. But can't pick up the phone to call you tomorrow. 
these motherfuckers right here is literally trying to live off of your name right here, telling people that they know you. I bet you this person could not pick up the phone and call you, so they don't know you. Y'all are not cool. I feel you change every hour on the fucking hour, so they don't fucking know you. This person's in their head if they thought they knew to you that was an hour ago. Bitch, you don't know how much I grew an hour? Oh, yeah. I, I grew up since then. Seriously, this person ain't shit. Ain't shit working out for this person because they a cyber bully. They probably was trying to cyber bully you here or some shit. But that shit ain't work out. It ain't ever gonna work out. When you trying to do dumb, low vibrational shit like this to divine fam, divine masculine, you don't win. You never gonna win like this. Person playing the game that they're never gonna win that they created. How the fuck you create a game and then you don't win your own fucking game? Someone else has came in and wrote plays to this person's game here. <laughs> and they can't beat themselves. Stupid motherfucker, because they're stuck. They wanted you to be, you know, mentally fucked up here. Now they are stuck. As to why they can't beat themselves at their own games here. Calling judgment in the future, okay? Spirit, can you please give me this final energy here? What's the outcome of this energy? <laughs> What's the outcome? What's the outcome in this energy here? Judgment to a thief and a player is the future energy. The energy that you will indeed come into contact with. Having to make a final judgment call from a crime that this person committed. <laughs> Virgo energy with the hermit falling out, okay? Self-introspection, somebody is, you know, I guess needing some time to deliberate here. Something that's very revealed, something that you know that's not gonna cause you to, this, this is not gonna do anything for you. Um, whether this was revealed to the public, that won't do shit for you. The only thing that will do something for you is to know the wins, why's house, what's all of that. Okay, here, the details, the intricate details is what matters to you. This person is going, um, into like a jail setting or a mental, like a mental institution setting. I'm getting mental institution vibes here as the outcome. They will be in hermit because of the shit that they kept doing over and over again. They kept stealing over and over again. This person kept playing over and over again. So they will be in a five of fucking pentacles. That's just what the false fear said. Because this person was not going to stop. They were going to continue playing games. They were going to continue to spend money on spell work. Continue to try to reveal secrets. Continue to bring towers here. Do things that could not be, you know, fixed basically. Do uh, break, you know, uh, barriers that were not meant to be broken. This person right here is being very nosy, um, inserting themselves and shit that they got no right. So their karma or their outcome will be to be left in the fucking um, color right here from any and everything when it regards you or anyone else because this person is reckless with their thoughts in general. Okay? This person's being judged, period, that they're not, they should not and they cannot be trusted. Okay? In the fucking community. With freedom... This person is going to continue to show that they're going to do the same shit. That they will have no love for anybody. That they won't vibrate with love. They won't do shit with love. This person can, they consistently shows, continually show themselves, you know, to you. They continually show themselves to God, you know, and, and they don't care. They know God watching them. They know spirit watching. They know, you know here, you know the rules of all of this divine shit here. And I feel like somebody just ran out of time. They ran out of ideas and they just ran out of motivation. Probably because they ran out of fucking money. But see, you didn't run out. It ain't no coincidence. This shit been taken away. It's being taken the fuck away from you because you had too much invested in trying to, you know, bring harm to a divine being. Or to another human being, period. This is not uh, serving humanity. This is not serving your purpose here. 
Look, something's coming in very quick. Karma, <laughs> judgment, eight of wands energy. Maybe about eight days. Somebody been sitting back watching some shit, okay? Watching this empress. Watching something that may be, you know, pertaining to this empress. I don't know what the fuck they could be. I don't know your story, okay? Here, but God been watching this person. Sitting back watching them, judging them. Okay, seeing if they were going to walk away from these dumbass ideas and they did not, or you didn't. You didn't walk away and you were supposed to. You should have left this alone or they should have. And now this person sees clearly that they're not going to be single and abundant when it comes to this fucking empress. When it comes to the empress, they're not going to ever win. They're playing a game that they're not going to win. They created this shit. And now it's an ending. The fuck? It's a whole ending right here. And this Aquarius is pissed. Queen of Swords in the damn reverse. This person's mad as hell. Okay? They're mad because all the, the shenanigans, the tactics, none of that shit didn't work. And the shit that they tried to reveal, nobody even gave a fuck about. This person didn't even get a chance to reveal it. Nobody would have even gave a fuck, though, is what I'm saying. Nobody would have cared. Anything else? Spirit said you got new love. Spirit said you have new love, brand new love here. That's just what the fuck it is. You got new love, and this person, they are going to be confused because you have it. That's what their punishment will be, to see you have new love. Some shit that they didn't want for you. They tried to turn the hands of time back is what I heard. But this person did not cherish you. They didn't respect you. This person did not. And therefore, they're going to be in karma. That's justice. That's what the fuck is going. Okay, guys?